What's up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? Stormstriker69 here with part 18 of my Pokemon Fire Red Let's Play. In the last episode, we started from Silidon City, we went back to Lavender Town, and from there, we went down the Fisherman Trail, where we got the Super Rod, and we also fought another Snorlax that was blocking our way. We didn't capture that Snorlax, but we did, since we already caught the one in Silidon City, we didn't really need two of them. So, yeah. Then after that, we made our, we battled some trainers along the way, most of them being fishermen and um, pool trainers and picnickers and things like that. And then uh, bird trainers as well. And then we also made our way to Fuchsia City, where we are now. So next up, I think I'm going to take on the Fuchsia City Gym first. And then after that, we will make our way into the Safari Zone and grab Surf. And then make our way back up to Silidon City. So first up will be... Fuchsia City Gym. So let's get started, shall we? Hope you guys enjoy. Enjoy. Hope you guys enjoy. If you do, don't forget to click the like button, comment below, share with your friends, add the favorites, and click that subscribe button. And also click the notification bell to know when I upload new videos. Alright, let's get started. Update on my team. Blaze is level 42, Ragezilla is level 40, Sparky is level 40, Toad is level 40, Snake is level 40, and Scully is level 40 as well, and also is finally evolved into a Marowak, and is still holding the experience share. So we're going to do the uh, Fuchsia City Gym first. It's been a bit since we did a gym, so why not? Let's mark the city on the map in the Pokemon Center first. All right. Make sure we're all healed up. Well, you know. All right. Yo, champ in the making! Fuchsia Gym is a tricked-up place. It's riddled with invisible walls. Koga might appear close, but he's blocked off. You have to find gaps in the walls to reach him. All right, we got some trainer battles. Go. Strength isn't the key for Pokemon. Do you understand this? Pokemon is about strength. Strategy. I'll show you how strategy can beat brute strength. Juggler Caden would like to battle. It's out Hypno. Ah, I sure am glad I did the grinding. Level 38 Hypno. Hypno with the Psychic. Hypno used Poison Gas. Blaze was poisoned, oh no. Blaze is hurt by poison.
Hypno fainted. Juggler Kaden was defeated. What? Extraordinary! I was a magician once upon a time, but I, I dreamt of becoming a ninja. So I joined this gym. Juggler Kirk would like to battle. Sent out Drowsy. Go Blaze. Level 31 Drowsy. Drowsy fainted. Next up is another Drowsy. Oh, Blaze is hurt by poison. Drowsy fainted. Next up is Kadabra. Flamethrower. Dabra fainted. Next up is Drowsy. Another Drowsy. Drowsy fainted. Juggler Kirk was defeated. I'm done for. All right, and I'm all healed up. Let's continue. I also study the way of the ninja with Master Koga. Ninja have a long history of using animals. Gamer Edgar would like to battle. Sent out Arbok. Go Blaze. Arbok's Intimidate cuts Blaze's attack. Flamethrower. Arbok fainted. Next up is Sand Slap. Come on out, Rage Villa. Sand Slash is level 33. Water Pulse. It's super effective. Dash Slash Fainted. Next up is another Arba. Level 33. Arbok Sativity cuts Ragezilla's attack. Arbok is confused. Arbok is confused. Arbok used poison stain. Uh oh, Ragezilla was poisoned. Ragezilla is hurt by poison. Dragon. 
Dragon Raid! Arbok is confused! Uh oh, Arbok used fight! The confusion is not setting in! Another Dragon Rage! Arbok finally fainted! Tamer Edgar was defeated! Oh, Master Koga comes from a long line of ninjas. What did you descend from, Pokemon Masters? Juggler Sean would like to battle. Sent out Drowsy. Go Blaze. Drowsy's level 34. Drowsy fainted. Next up is Hypno. Flamethrower. Hypno's level 34. Hypno used confusion. Wing attack. Hypno fainted. Blaze grew to level 43. Juggler Sean was defeated. You're more skilled than I thought. Stop right there. The famed invisible walls of Fuchsia Gym have you frustrated? Tamer Phil would like to battle. Sent out Sand Slash. Go Blaze! Flamethrower! Sand Slash fainted. Scully grew to level 41. Next up is Arbok. This is a poison gem after all. There will be a lot of these. Arbok is level 34 and just used Intimidate to cut Blaze's attack. Arbok fainted. Tamer Phil was defeated. Whoa, you've got it. <laughs> A mere child like you dares to challenge me? The very idea makes me shiver with mirth. Very well, I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. Poison brings st steady doom. Sleep renders foes helpless. Despair to the creeping horror of poison type Pokemon. All rise to the Pokemon of the poison type. Leader Koga sent out coughing. Go Blaze.
Nothing fainted. Next up is Ma. Muck is level 39. A critical hit. Muck fainted. Next up is coughing. Coughing's level 37. Coughing fainted. Next up is Wheezing. Wheezing's level 43. Looks like we're out of flamethrower. Wheezing used Sludge. Wing attack. Wheezing used Toxic. Uh-oh. That means Blaze is now poisoned. Blaze is hurt by poison. Wheezing used sm Smoke Screen. Its accuracy fell. And Blaze is hurt by poison. Koga is using a Hyper Potion. Oh no! Weezing's Hyper Potion restored health. Blaze's attack missed. And he, oh no! This is a fight. Come on out, Scully. Weezing used Sludge on Scully. It's not very effective. Bone Meringue. Weezing using Smoke Screen. Scully's accuracy fell. Scully used Bone Meringue, but the attack missed. Oh yeah, Faux Weezing makes... Oh no. That's not good. Weezing's got the levitate ability. And Scully was poisoned. Just so you guys know, guys know, poison type Pokemon are weak to ground type moves, but in this case of Weezing, who's got levitate, that's not the case anymore. Switching Pokemon again. Another sludge attack. Oh, wow, this is a formidable fight here, and uh, we just lost Sparky. Sparky didn't even get a chance to fight. Sparky fainted. Uh-oh. Yeah, I got a strange feeling we're going to lose this battle, guys. I thought we were ready. I really thought we were ready. And we just lost Ra Ragezilla to a critical hit. Oh my god, we're... You know what to say, if we lose, we go back and battle them again. Glare. There you go, use your glare attack. Weezing is now paralyzed. It may not be able to move. Weezing use sludge. It's not very effective. Oh 
my goodness. This is bad, 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 bad. No! He used a full heal! Gosh dang it! I don't care! Blair again! Weezing is paralyzed again. It may be unable to move. Weezing flinch. I will say this, Koga is one of the tough battles in this game. I am not making this up. And this time he, oh, he just used another hyper potion. I, I will say this, we may lose this battle, or we'll be miraculously winning with this Arbok. Pikachu nearly died in one hit, one swoop, hit, and didn't even get a chance to fight. We, we, we grinded the level 40 and still not able to take out the Weezing. I thought I was ready. Can we do it? Or is he going to use another Hyper Potion and then we're doomed? We did it! Weezing finally fainted! Thank you, Snake! Thank you, Arbok! You saved the day and won the battle! Snake is the VIP for this episode. Dolly gained some experience. Leader Koga was defeated! Oomph! You have proven your worth! Here, take the soul badge. Storm got 4,300 for winning. Now that you have the soul badge, the defense of your Pokemon raises. It also lets you surf outside of battle. Ah, take this too. Storm received TM06 from Koga. Sealed within that TM06 lies Toxic. It is a secret technique dating back from 400 years ago. When, when inflected by Toxic, a Pokemon suffers more and more. It suffers worsening damage as the battle wears on. It will surely terrorize foes. Okay, okay, jeez. I keep pressing the A button. Man, that was a tough battle. But in the end, we won. Yes, I thought I was gonna lose because everybody was getting sweeped by his wheezing. Almost everybody is poisoned. Can we make it to the Pokemon Center before we all faint? Oh my goodness, we need to heal fast. Thank you, Nur Nurse Joy. We needed that. That was one tough battle. Thank you for waiting. You restored your Pokemon to full health. You are no longer poisoned. We hope to see you again. That was one tough battle with Koga's Weezing at level 43. We were, yes, I was at level 40, but I was surprised to see that his Weezing was level 43. So it was still a tough battle in the end. All right, so we just got through taking on Koga and got the Soul Badge. It was a tough battle in the end, but we prevailed using my Arbok Snake. And uh, no, he's not named after Snake from Metal Gear. That's probably what you thought. Maybe it is, maybe it's not, you know. <laughs> Anyways, um, 
We just defeated Koga and got the soul badge. It was a tough battle in the end, but we prevailed. And uh, I will say this again. If you ever go up against Koga, you know, either on the Pokemon Red, Blue, Yellow, or Fire Red, Leaf Green, and uh, you face him, be get, make sure you have a prepared team because he is a poison type gym leader and a po and the master of the poison type and uh yeah so it was a tough battle and uh make sure you're well trained before you get to him um i thought i was ready i i nearly got sweeped anyways um that's it for this episode. If you enjoyed, don't forget to click the like button, comment below, share with your friends, add to favorites, and click that subscribe button. And also click the notification bell to know when I upload new videos. See you guys next time.